Hi guys, this is Steve from Time to Dessert. As you may already know, usually during the weekends I go out and try different desserts around London or other cities around the world. But I realized that it's easy to judge other people's work, so for that reason I would like to have more hands-on experience with cooking and baking desserts myself. So I decided that I will start another playlist or section on my YouTube channel, which will be called Time to Dessert Kitchen, where occasionally on the ugly rainy days like this, I will do some cooking and baking, some recipes which I already know and with which I've won so many hearts already, or some other recipes which I would like to learn to cook or bake myself. So this will be my first video where I'm going to prepare my favorite recipe for the French crepes. I call them crepes à la chef, but I think the proper name is actually crepes Suzette. I did this recipe many times already. It's quite simple and easy to make, so I think anyone should be able to, to make it. And it's delicious, and that's what we are after on this channel. Okay, so the recipe is quite simple. You need 75 grams of plain flour. You need 220 milliliters of milk. I usually use whole milk, but you can probably use whatever you want. We need two eggs and a little bit of salt and some oil or you can use butter as well. For the topping we will need some sugar, brown sugar the best, a little bit of butter and we will need an orange. You will make, I usually do it for more people, I usually do it from two batches, but this will be like five to six pancakes, so for two people that's pretty much enough. You can also add some brandy or orange liquor, but I don't have anything like that. I usually just do it with the orange. So let's do it. Pretty simple. I usually prepare the orange zest and orange juice first, as it is the most difficult part of making crepe Suzette. Then you put flour with a little bit of salt and half of the milk into the bowl. Mix it together and pour the rest of the milk into it with two eggs and a little bit of oil or melted butter. Whisk everything together until you have nice and creamy liquid. So my dough is ready. It took me literally five minutes to prepare it. Now I'm going to warm up the pan and I'm ready. This part's like the longest time, it's quite boring. The trick to flipping the pancake is not to be afraid of it. Magic! So just like that, I have seven pancakes right here. Now the next step is to making triangles out of them. I made the delicious crepes, I made the triangles as well, now I'm going to make the sauce and we're almost done. This is actually the longest part of the whole making of the crepes. It's the making the dough, making the sauce, everything is super fast, but I actually wait to make the seven crepes that takes, it took me at least half an hour, but oh, they smell so, so good already. Good. To make the sauce, melt a good chunk of butter and add brown sugar. While constantly mixing it, wait for sugar to caramelize and then add orange juice and orange zest. At this point you can add some brandy as well or some orange liquor, I don't have anything like that so I will just leave it like it is. Now place the crepes into it and let it nicely absorb all the delicious sauce. Whoa, and we are done! That's it! Ooh, it smells so good, I can't wait to try it. Voila, crepes Suzette, let's give it a try. Oh, nice and juicy. Smells very orangey. Mm. Absolutely delicious. It's a little bit sweet, the orange flavor is there as well. I think probably the, the orange liquor or brandy can give it a little bit more tongue, but I'm, I'm totally happy without it as well. Okay, so I believe that was a huge success for the first video, not bad. Yeah, I enjoyed it a lot, it was delicious. This is still one of my most favorite recipes of the French crepes. Thank you very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. Definitely let me know in the comments if you had success making crepes Suzette. 
And until next time, it's time to go to gym.